Hello friends, we're so glad that you joined us today as we study God's Word together. I'm Travis and it's time to tune into this week's FCC Pulse. Each January, our church takes a week to focus on prayer together with an event that we call Seven Days of Prayer. This year, from January 7th through the 13th, we will meet each evening from 7 to 7.30 p.m. in the Worship Center at the Greenville campus. Join us as our team of residents take turns sharing a short devotional thought and lead us in a time of prayer. Learn more at fccgreen.org slash 7DOP. Take your next step at FCC by coming to our monthly Next Steps meeting on January 7th at 9 a.m. at every campus. Identify with Christ in baptism, place membership, or just come find out who we are as a church and get connected with some FCC veterans. What better way to start the new year than to reconnect, resurrect, or reignite your marriage? Whether your marriage is broken or you just want to take your good marriage to the next level, we invite you to join the next session of Reengage, which starts January 8th. Sign up at fccgreen.org slash marriage. Your marriage is worth the investment. Every new year, as a way for all of us to reconsider our commitment and assess our spiritual health, we take our membership role all the way down to zero and require members to re-up. So during January, we send out a spiritual health survey that we ask all FCCers to fill out. Those who are active members the year before can renew for 2024 on the form. Now to be clear, to be an active member, you must renew every year. There's no such thing as an ongoing membership status from year to year without renewing one's membership. And unfortunately, if you fail to renew for one year, we will change your membership status to loser. Just kidding, but we will change your membership status to inactive or not a member. This spiritual assessment is actually really helpful not only because it's a moment for you to assess your spiritual health, but it also helps our leaders better understand how to effectively shepherd our people. Uh, so don't be a loser. I mean, so renew today by texting the word survey, S-U-R-V-E-Y, to 423-639-0126, or by clicking on the link on the app, or by going to fccgreen.org slash renew. Last Sunday simply was amazing. It was beautiful to celebrate the birth of Jesus together in a worshipful service at Tuscum University. It was such an encouraging time to see all three campuses together in one place, singing and worshiping the Prince of Peace, who came to save. It was so lovely to connect with friends, new and old, over coffee and cookies. You can read more about how God used this service for His glory on the app. We want to stay connected with you, and the best way for that to happen is when you fill out the Connect card and drop it into the bucket when it is passed by your way. Share your prayer requests and comments, ask some questions, and take your next step. Well, that wraps up this week's FCC Pulse. Today, we will be in 1 John chapter 3, verse 4. Follow along on the sermon guide on the app. And to keep up with all the latest news at FCC, go to Pulse on the app. Thank you.